Uh, the biggest bet that I made as a CEO in terms of resource commitment was in 2006, making India my second world headquarters. But we did that for a simple reason. We were after really the best talent in the industry that could build the best products, service it, and be our foundation for globalization. We did not see India as a startup market at that time, and we did not see a country that was a leader more of a slow follower. Uh, you fast forward to today, most people would say I'm the biggest bull on in India and have been for the last seven years since Modi mm -hmm. came in. And when people ask why, the answer is very simple. It's about leadership. You know that in the startups in this room, if you really like the CEO, there's a great vision and strategy. The energy is there. They inspire hope. They get you to believe. They knock it down and go forward. I think Prime Minister Modi, I say, is one of the top three leaders in the world that I've met over my lifetime. I think he actually may be the best. But the other reason is very simple. Uh, if you look at India with the demographics involved, and we all know the statistics, we're more than half the population is below 26. Uh, we look at a democracy across 28 states. You look at a leader that outlines the best digitization plan in the world, a digital India with digital manufacturing, startups, mm -hmm. smart cities. And you look at the IITs cranking out the number of really qualified engineers at 600,000 a year top three or four percent of the population probably in IQ, uh, and you look at the U.S. at only 60,000, and you realize that once this engine kicked into gear about the ability of startups to really make a difference, then India and the U.S. should be the most strategic alliance in the world, which I believe it is becoming and yeah, will become very well. Moving to Together, it. we're going to change the world. So yeah. to say I believe in India would be an understatement. I, I do it for a very simple reason. Mm -hmm. I think India will evolve not just in the top three economies, but has a very real chance of becoming the top economy in the world. So believer in India would be an understatement.